Prom season is here, so break out the tuxes, the fancy nails, heels, and of course that dress. But before you take your teen shopping or they bring home a dress, know what's trending. Joining me now is Sarah Scoop blogger Sarah Rollman. And Sarah, you've brought along three models who are modeling your top picks for prom dresses trends this season and the hottest new things we should look for. But first, let's talk about your dress because this is gorgeous. Okay, so the dress that I'm wearing, like, obviously I'm not, you know, prom age anymore. You could be. But, <laughs> but I was looking for something that I could get from the same yeah. kind of feel. And it's just a fun gold dress that you can wear. It's trendy for a formal event or even a wedding that you want to just have fun with. Now, when I'm out with my family around prom season, I see these girls looking gorgeous. They are decked out head to toe in these really long dresses. Yes. Can they wear a shorter dress or is that too casual for prom? No, these days? absolutely. I feel like prom is all about being comfortable with what you're wearing. Like that is a night you're supposed to have fun. So yeah. wear something. If you like a short dress, wear a short dress. Obviously you want to make sure that it's dressy and stylish, yeah. but... Well, the metallic does Yes, that. and it has like a fun flow, too. I love that. Let's get to your models. Yes. Model number one is wearing a beautiful navy color with cap sleeves. Absolutely, and you can see the um, detailed lace in mm -hmm. this dress, and if she turns to the side, it kind of flows through through the waist area as well, just cinching it's in. It's beautiful. And it, we're going with that long, traditional yeah. prom theme in dresses, but with these, they have just a little something to them, but they're all very affordable. They're from both, um, all the looks are from Prom Girls and Simply Dresses, and they're all $99. $99. Yes. Model number two is wearing this gorgeous blush color, uh, a pleated chiffon number. So one is navy, two has that pleated chiffon, which is really unique. Yes, and look how flattering this is. She can yeah. freely move throughout the night and dress, like dance, have fun, and not feel like, it's, you know, holding her back at all. And also, like, these dresses can be worn elsewhere. Like, that would make a beautiful wedding dress as yes, well, like, if you're for a wedding wanting. event. Yes. If you wanted to, could you make that shorter? If you were done with prom and you weren't going to wear a long gown anymore, could you take it to a tailor and make it a shorter dress? Absolutely, yes. And I love the way you're thinking because that's what's important about big events. You spend a lot of money on these. Yes. You need to buy dresses and wear dresses that you can reuse later. We don't need to have them just sitting in our closets. Right, right. You can donate yeah. them, but donate. if you can get yeah. a twofer out of it before that, that's yes. always nice. Model number three. Okay, so gorgeous this burgundy yeah, color. Absolutely. This takes on more of the traditional prom dress that you are used to seeing. Mm -hmm. um, and this one is so fun. I love it. It has a skirt underneath. You can see that that is layered with the puffier material outside of it to just make a more formal look. What's that look called on the bottom? Is there a name for it? Because I see that um, It's similar to like the high-low. Yeah. Just beca because we have it, um, or the, well, it'd be like opposite, like the lower Asymmetrical skirt. Asymmetrical yes. kind of look, right. Mm -hmm. Is anything out of style this year where girls are going out shopping with their parents and they see it? It looks like a great deal, but it's not really in style. So, yeah, I would say overspending is very, oh, that's out of style? Like, out of I love that. In my, okay. Out. okay. Well, like, when you're in high school, you think, I'm going to spend $500 on this dress. Like, you don't need to do that. Like, and then also the beaded. I love seeing more of this kind of beaded material opposed uh -huh. to, like, the whole top covered in beads where that's, like, uncomfortable, too. Like, yeah. your arms rub on it, that kind of thing. Yeah, it's heavy. Yes. It's hot. I got a question for you. You just brought this one out of me when you said the $500, which is... It's more than my wedding dress. But stuff. it's true. I'm... When did that start? Because when I was back in the olden days, I remember going to Penny's and you just picked a cute dress and that's what you wore to prom. I when mean, did this start? at least for 10 years, I know girls yeah. that were spending hundreds of dollars oh on prom dresses. And I mean, you should definitely enjoy the night, but it is one night. <laughs> yeah, and you don't have to spend that much. Case you don't. Point, three gorgeous, well, four gorgeous dresses. Yeah. And they were all. And Much there's so cost. many choices, like pick a color that looks yeah. good on your skin tone. And like most important, I think it's just about like wearing something you're comfortable in so you can have fun. Yeah, so make sure you can sit in it, you can eat in it, and you can dance in it. And when it's affordable, like, you know, what a, if you're dancing all night, you run the bottom, you right. can chop it off. It's all right, <laughs> chop it off and wear it as a mini. Sarah Scoop blogger Sarah Rollman with her three beautiful models with the trending prom dresses this season. Thank you, ladies, and thank you, Sarah. Thank you so much. Coming up, we have an